So I got a bit of a review to do in a second, but uh, I got the pool open. Just wanted to open the thing and set everything up and sell it because we moved here in the winter and it's an above ground pool. I think it's kind of useless. I think uh, with the money there could be a lot more useful things done with it. So we're going to pull the pool out, put a fire pit in, and use any money left over to work on the barn in there. But, I mean, you can see I put like window tar tape on there, it didn't really do anything. You can see it's dripping. Uh, it wasn't winterized properly, so the fitting in there was cracked. The pump was full of water when I pulled it out. The pump was inside, but it was full of water, like in the shed. Seized, so I did a video on that. I'm seizing it. Works good now, but I don't know if I'll put that up or not. So, and there's another one going up soon of the server flooding. Like, server is in a closet in the basement. Basement flooded in that corner, and it's snowing. Yeah, it's starting to snow. It's bloody cold. It was been nice for the past few weeks, but we're about one degree today. It's been pouring rain all week. Server flooded. I only realized it flooded because I went down because it wasn't working. The CPU actually fried, which has nothing to do with it. That's the flood, but uh, I replaced the CPU and then I went down to check something the other day. I forget what it was, but it was... Oh, I uh, wanted to do some work on the cable connections. And... Yeah, there's an inch of water down there. Only right where the electronics are, which I can't really move because that's where the cable comes in. So we're a week from May, and it's snowing. This was boarded up. I pulled the board off. Uh, I can see why it was boarded up now. It's all rotted. So I'm going to have to replace that. Anyhow, enough of the rambling. review this tripod thing which I wanted to get to make videos for. Yeah, another thing I want to replace these doors. This is horrible. It doesn't shut properly. There's holes in it. So I don't know if I posted a video on this place before. I know I made some, but the electrical is all screwy so I'm still working on it, but I redid it all. Here, hang on a second. I redid all the electrical uh, back from here and run it down surface mounted boxes so the switch was over here I thought it was kind of weird so the door is not gonna when I get the new door or build the new door it's gonna open this way so we got the light switch here there was only that light I added that one and rewired it all the wires are just kind of sitting there I have the, the straps I just haven't put them on so I've got that side done, this is all in one breaker, and I've got a GFCI there, which was outside. I mean, which was right there. It's going to be put outside also on that 15 amp breaker. And on the other 15 amp breaker is going to be that one, which isn't hooked up yet, but that outlet and that outlet. And because any power tools, baked tools, will all be plugged into that. This one's here just for the compressor and charging drill batteries and stuff. Uh, another thing I'm going to do is tear this bench out. I don't know what I'll do with this thing. It was only like $40 I bought it a year or two ago. And what I'm going to do is put uh, 2 by 6 24 inches long, which is what this is now, so 5 pieces of 2 by 6 8 feet long, which will put it to the edge of the window. And then 8 feet that way, which will put it to that stud there, right to the right of the receptacle. So it'll give me a nice big bench. Anyhow, enough for the updates. So this is what I ordered on Amazon. It was only like 5 bucks. Um, Walmart has those selfie things that you stick your phone in, and it's like a monopod. And they were like 20 this was on Amazon. 
I ordered it March 17th and it came in two days ago, which was April 21st. So, yeah, it was more than a month. And it said for Samsung Galaxy S4. Actually, I ordered it the day before the last video went up. I, I think it went up on the 18th. On the 18th, because I bought this, went out the next day and bought the phone. So I mean, the tripod. It's just an ordinary dollar for a tripod. But what I was hoping was, I just wanted that bracket. And then this thing unscrews, and then that'll just go with a normal tripod. So, unfortunately, this goes up, fits this way, but this doesn't extend out enough. It was spring-loaded, but trying to put the phone in broke the spring off. So, this isn't high enough to actually fit an S4. If you pull it up past the lock and take it off like that, and put the phone in without a case on and then just stick this back in you can get you can get your phone in there but it's obviously not for an S4 now I did recommend this to a couple people just because they were looking for a tripod for their phone I said hey this is only five bucks Chinese how bad can it be but apparently now, I might be able to make it work well enough to use for what I need it for to get the video, so let's just do a little bit of a demo here. Okay, so now it's on the tripod. I'm just holding the tripod in my hands. Um, yeah, so I got the otter box on the phone, but the, the top mount is just barely sitting on there. I don't have anything else to really show it off with. But, I mean, I guess it's enough to hold the phone. The phone's sitting at a bit of an angle. So maybe I can make something up for it. Maybe there's another one. But we'll dress this up properly here. And try to balance this out. Okay, so it seems to be decent enough to record footage from. So I'll just make it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do a bit of a shake test. Now, I'm not even actually shaking it. I'm just moving the tripod on the table, and it's really shaking the hell out of the phone. So, yeah. Okay, that about shows how well it was attached. So, this was sitting on here, just like that. Just barely in there and that's the only way I can fit this phone on here even though the website even though Amazon said for its Galaxy S4 now it didn't say S4 mini it probably would work for an S4 mini and uh, actually let me get a smaller phone to try it an S4, let me get an S4 mini all right so I got a Galaxy Ace 2 here I didn't set S4 mini but it's about the same size so we'll try to put it on See if this one works. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this off camera because the tripod's in front of me. Even with this phone that's a, quite a bit smaller, I mean, I do have the skin on it still, but it barely made it. As you can see, it's still bent there. Now we're, we're at the very top of how of the lock here. So anything past this would pop the thing off. So, even this tiny Android phone does not fit as, I mean, it barely fits. It's probably the biggest phone you'll fit in here. Yet, it said it's for a Galaxy S4. So if I push this down and pull it back up, that's how high the lock is supposed to go. The phone, without still pulling it off the lock, doesn't fit. Like you can see that it just doesn't fit. Now I could probably get away with it by taking off this rubber thing. Yes. Wait. No.
just barely still. So if the spring was engaged, putting that on will push down on your lock button and shut your phone off anyhow. So my verdict on this is useless really. I did I did recommend it to a couple of people because of the price, but uh, it seems it seems like a good idea. I think it would be okay if this was able to go twice as high. Now maybe I can modify something to make it work properly. I mean, I think I can make it work good enough for what I need it to do. Maybe. But, yeah. This isn't something you want to buy. Okay, so this is the package that it came in. And if you look at it, that doesn't look like a phone. That looks like an old Nokia phone. So, it said for a Galaxy S4, but... I mean, obviously the phone described here isn't an S4. It said, it said for Wi-Fi, or Wi-Fi, sorry. My phone just gave an error. Anyhow, it said for iPhone and Galaxy S4. It says on the back, suitable for locating different size of phones, easy to adjust, safe and shockproof. So, I'm going to play around with this a little bit, see if I can make something usable. And if I can, I'll let you guys know in the next video.